Right guys, how we doing? Welcome back to another video. Uh, 100 days. One hundy. The big hundo. One double zero. 100 days clean and sober from, uh, from pornography. For watching, from watching porn. Online porn. Um, started with pictures, actually. Started with pictures, for me. That's all you could get. You know, the internet was so fucking slow. Five kilobytes per second, I think, you could download. And so videos were just simply not an option. Uh, that was before the broadband days. That's how it all started with me. Pictures. And uh, then we went to video form, and then cell phones came out, and then you could get the internet on your cell phone, and then you could uh, pick up your phone, and uh, wherever you like, wherever in the world you wanted, at whatever time, in the privacy of your own home, or your bedroom, or your bathroom, or the shower, or wherever you chose to do the deed in, and you could access it. <laughs> Just made it so much more accessible, so much easier, so much more insidious as an addiction, and for the last hundred days I have not uh, engaged in it, and I feel good. I feel proud, but has it really changed my life in any huge way no no it's just another positive change that i've tr that i've added uh to my life to try and live in uh in a more healthy and positive way really um i don't want i don't i don't want to bring anything into my life that has the risk and i'm not saying it would but it has the risk of making me feel uh bad about myself or ashamed of myself or that will sacrifice my want to engage in real life with the opposite sex. Uh, I'm 33, still got youth on my side, I've still got time to, to meet a, a partner and get married, but at the end of the day, I don't, I don't think I'm ever going to get married, I really don't. Um, I'm pretty convinced of that now. And, but you know, I certainly was never going to get married if I was going to continue uh, doing what I was doing in that department. So basically all that's happened, like I said, nothing, nothing crazy, no, no, no uh, huge changes that I can report on, but what it has done is that it's at least opened the opportunity or opened the door to uh, the option of having a meaningful relationship with a woman. Um, because for the longest time, guys, I can admit this, it doesn't matter how beautiful that woman was, number one, I hadn't, you know, I was completely out of practice with courting a woman and, and, and going through with dates and shit like that, completely out of practice, but I, I didn't want to, I couldn't be fucked. I'd rather just go home look at my phone for five or ten minutes sometimes 30 I must admit but I'd rather just go home and do it and do that because it's so much easier so much easier but uh, far less fulfilling in fact it was it was uh, yeah that was one of the, the main reasons why I had to stop is because you know it was just the complete opposite of fulfilling it left me empty it left me exhausted and it was something that just had to stop. I've been doing it every single day for like 16, 17, 18 years, guys. I didn't know if I could stop, but I have. And you can too. So just a bit of a check-in, day 100, uh, feeling good about it. I'm not feeling any, you know, like I said, there's no crazy changes, but it's just, subtle changes in my mindset and the way that I live my life and it's positive and that's always a good thing.